State Farm is getting set to discontinue homeowner coverage in parts of San Diego County. And tonight we can break down which zip codes are targeted. CBS 8's Shannon Handy looks at the list and tells us why experts warn even customers who are not getting dropped are still being impacted. In California, State Farm is dropping 30,000 homeowners insurance policies. That includes people living in 50 zip codes across San Diego County. With what's happened in our insurance market, these carriers are just not profitable in California. Matthew Clark with C3 Insurance knows all about the fallout from State Farm's decision to not renew tens of thousands of policies in California. Many of his clients live in Rancho Santa Fe, where 50% of all State Farm policies are getting dropped. So I had a client reach out, and he's getting a cancellation in July. His premium with State Farm was around 12000 and his new premium is going to be forty. With another company? Mm hmm Overnight. You know, it just happened. You know, they're used to paying a normalized premium for the area, but now they're looking at, you know, almost 4X. Earlier this week, State Farm disclosed where, starting this summer, they will discontinue coverage, citing inflation, regulatory costs, and increasing risks from catastrophes. Of the 50 impacted zip codes in San Diego County, ones located in Rancho Santa Fe topped the list, followed by Hamul, Tierra Santa, Lakeside, El Cajon, and Mission Valley. It's definitely a difficult time right now. It's about as bad as it's ever been in my 30 plus years doing this. Carl Sussman is an insurance industry expert. His best advice for those impacted is to start looking for a new insurer right away and don't hesitate when you find an alternative plan, even though it's likely more than what you're used to paying. If you're getting a non-renewal letter from State Farm today, it doesn't mean your coverage ends tomorrow. It means you're going to be non-renewed at your next policy renewal. That means you should take the time right now, as much time as you can, to start looking for replacement coverage because replacement coverage, as you probably know, is very hard to come by. If you find something that you can get right now, don't wait for your policy to be non-renewed. Take that new policy. You can either have duplicate coverage or you can just cancel the State Farm policy earlier. You can always sign up for the state's fair plan, which is available to everyone, but it's pricey, doesn't offer as much coverage, and there's a backup right now with so many people applying. Another thing to keep in mind, if you're not getting dropped, State Farm's credit rating has been downgraded to a B, meaning some of its customers may have trouble getting claims paid. For a list of impacted zip codes, visit CBS8.com and click on this story. Shannon Handy, CBS8.